Hello, my friend. What's up? Are you all right? I hope you are. God bless you. God bless your family. In this class, we continue talking about ants, but we're going to see positive effects of ants now. We, we have studied about fire ants, which are very dangerous, which have caused a big loss in many countries. And we finished last class saying that scientists believe that fire ants might well spread across half the planet. So, what does this mean? Is it all bad? It is well known that earthworms, earthworms, have a look, earthworms are farmers' best friend. They improve the quality of farmland by turning over the soil. This helps to get air into the soil, which enables more water to be absorbed and crop production to increase. However, what many people don't realize is that many species of ant are even more beneficial to soil than earthworms. It has been discovered, for example, that the holes most ants make in the earth allow more rain to be absorbed. Some ants also act as natural pesticides, killing harmful crop-eating insects and protecting plants. In fact, the earliest known use of biological pest management by Chinese orange growers was described in a book written by Chinese botanist Hsi Han in AD 340, 340 years after Christ's death. This AD means after death, after the death of Christ. Bamboo bridges were provided by the farmers which allowed the ants to move from tree to tree in order to reach and kill the bad insects. Now I want you to tell me, how can ants improve the soil? How can ants improve the crops? Where does this guy who wrote about the power of ants in helping crops come from? Answer these questions. I want to see your answer. Don't worry if, oh no, I don't know exactly, my answer is not correct. Relax, just answer, participate, write, practice your English, okay? Share this class with your friends, like, like, comment, interact with the video. Thank you very much. I'm Felipe Gibi. See you next class. Ants are also important distributors of seeds and play an important role in pollination.